Yeah, we're a heavy Vegemite household. Sorry, everyone. It used to be thick. And Americans definitely try this at home. It tastes just like chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring this video. If you want to design and build a beautiful website, you can do it all in one place with Squarespace. So today we're going to do some painting. Rocket gave me this paper roll that he can't use anymore, I think because it's been used a few times. And I'm going to paint all over it because I think it would be fun to be like a never ending roll. I don't know how much I'll be able to paint though. We'll see. You get up there. Three. Oh. Do you? You must watch card. Oh, I put my shoes on. What will we do first, you ask? I don't know. I'm scared. I think I'm just going to choose some of the acrylic colours and choose what's going to be contrasted well. Because there's no use in using reds, like that's insane. I guess we'll just try and start, hey? Because I can always rip it off if I go there. I'm going to do a mountain. Give me that swatch card, eh? Oh, I've spilt it. No. Candone. Oh, that is Lux. Do I do a little oil pastel swatch? Because I just feel that I won't do a good job. I don't want to waste all my acrylic gouache. That's a bit expensive, isn't it? Oh, no, it's wrinkling. It's a fail. Bigger, I said, no problem. I'll just try. Clean. Yeah, you've seen a mountain before, but have you seen a mountain like this before? Yeah, I have. Oh, okay, let's carry on then. Sorry about that. Funny, but not too funny. Real, but change things till they love me. So, what other shapes do I like to draw? I love to draw a flower, but I'm on red, so I can't really draw a flower, can I? I guess I have to do like an orangey or a yellow flower. That's cool, I'm prepared for that. So bold, so chic. Foot reveal. I'm gonna do a rainbow, because rainbows are cool. I thought this would be way more crazy and freeing, but it's not that crazy and freeing. I need to use this to make a star. Then we go crazy with the hair. Watch this. That's fun. Now that is what I call fun. Will it be good? It doesn't matter if it's good. This is called for fun. Yippee. And then we get a darker color. <gasps> you bastard. How am I gonna fix that? I know, I actually know. Oil pastels is fun on this, isn't it? You know what it's like? It's kind of like chalk drawings and stuff. Ignore that other rainbow business. Maybe I can turn it into something. I'll think about that later. Let's do another face, shall we? Because I've loved drawing faces. Check this out. She has bushy brows. What kind of hair will we have for this gal? What will we have? What, what will we have? We shall have something perfect for her head. Yes, we shall. Yes, we shall. That is a good mix of paint. This looks like a wig. <laughs> it's bizarre because it's a drawing. So why would it look like a wig? Wig representation. Cute. Very cute. Not so cute. Sorry, I just can't help myself. I'm just a lassie with a dream. Now I'm gonna draw faces on these little babes over here. Is this dry? Who minds? Not me. Oh, apparently the paper does mind. Who knew? The paper has feelings. 
That can be a shooting star. That doesn't have to be a failed rainbow. Hee <laughs> hee. That's the beauty of life. Anything can happen. I don't know what to do with my life. <laughs> <gasps> oh my god. It's called having fun with your friends, drawing things until the very end. The best time to plan a trip is a million years ago and the second best time is now and let that be a lesson to everyone other words of wisdom don't beat yourself up it's okay and that's all i have to say on that i like these other pastels they're actually a bit expensive they're like 40 dollars for a pack which is a bit expensive for what i'm using them for so first we'll draw eyes and then we'll figure out what we want the eyes to be a part of it's a tangelo my friends I want to do a caterpillar because I do love doing caterpillars lately. I think I will do one. I'm going to do a caterpillar, okay? This is fun because like, I could imagine this on a giant painting, you know? Get out of here, scram! Cool, I love that texture. So painterly for my style, don't you think? And I'll draw a stone. Come on, shoosh. Get your Mojo Jojo back. That's a stone. And then there'll be another stone on top. Then another stone on top. Then another stone on top, of course. Do you think that's what I probably not? Oh, it is. He's got all the pressure on him because he has to balance and carry. This one's on the floor. This one's like, I'm safe. Yeah, we do a little face. Let's do a hopscotch. <laughs> no, not like on it, but like, <laughs> it'd be cute because it's like almost like the same thing. One, two, three. How does it go? I don't get it. Is it like this? Da, 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 da. Is that hopscotch? D. Whoa. Boot. now bye don't leave your computer screens for one hour while we go get lunch you mind it while we're gone I'm a jean jacket check out that back window the little weird rando fit video I'm gonna do a flame next when I get back up there oh yeah you getting some ideas yeah I was like what else could I possibly draw now like there are things to the place just a bit of sustenance for the afternoon it is a large apple green tea, no sugar with white pearls. Oh, yeah. Bit sweet though, for no sugar. <laughs> it's quite sweet. <laughs> Makes me feel like there's a bit of sugar in there. <laughs> I think I'm going to roll it down and, and make more space for more work. Oopsies, I made a big old mess. Ah, oh, dirty. Draw a volcano now, that's what I'm gonna draw now. Oh, and I said a fire flame, remember? Whoops, I didn't wash my brush. Don't tell Thomas Jackson. <laughs> Here we go. This water is putrid. <laughs> and it will throw up in the final. Let's just see how bad it is, shall we? Ugh. Whoopsies. I know, I've gotta do my flame. What I don't like about doing this is standing up and getting down. Usually I can just sit down for like four hours, but for this, I have to get up and get sit down so many times. Mm -hmm. 
think you know what would be better if it was just spiky. I feel like hot has to be spiky, unless it's being super nice and friendly. And then I imagine it to be like like that. Just a thought. I hate it, sweetheart. It's okay. I'll fix it later. And I can't be bothered to get up and down all the time. It's too much, sweet, for little old me. I don't know. My oil pastels have gone. Where? Oh. <gasps> now here's what we do. This is where we're allowed to be like, whoa. Yeah. Blow away, old chap. Cool. Love how that mixes like that. It's so contrasted off that, the red. Cute, and then we want to do some smoke. We can use this, we can use this grey, and then that will go all the way over here. Love how that, like the ones that pop off the red are so nice. Blue on that red background is so nice. Oh, I can do some cloud. <laughs> oh, I haven't done a house yet. I have to draw a house. So much paint spilled today. So much blood wasted. <laughs> Oops, I can't even see when I'm doing I honestly can't fathom think when it's upside down. Oh! <laughs> oh no, it's a big one too! Oh no, that makes me so sad. Like there's nothing worse than this in my whole life. Oh no, no, no. <laughs> this is so sad. <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> Quick. For Mora. Yes. Oh no. Today, this is the worst thing that's happened today, which is not that bad, I guess. This is expensive and I got it from Japan. It's not worth that house that I drew. How do I even get it back in there? This is the saddest thing ever. Ay ay ay. Spin yourself on your butt. Turn around and don't let it on any more paint. Too late. Uh, guess I have to do some finger painting. <laughs> I'm just gonna finger paint with this. Gotta make the best out of a bad situation. This saddens me so much. Like I can't explain how much this saddens me. It's just like I mourn the paint. Like it's so sad. I swear I feel you at my feet. Finger painting is cute but hard and a waste of. I'd rather do it with like acrylic that's made for children and not like expensive Japanese acrylic. Imagine this is like this is the mistake, the happy accident, and I just turned my whole career into this. <laughs> I don't think so because it feels really bad to do. It's so messy and like sticky. I hate that I wasted that paint. I hate it. I remember buying it in Japan and stressing over how many to get and now it doesn't matter because I wasted half of it. It feels bad and I wasted paint. What a really sad moment. I want to go home now. Done for the day because I can't be trusted. This is what happens when you don't want to do it anymore. Your body says, no, I'll waste your paint. Well, I think that's a sign from the peach gods that I should stop. Let's unroll this and see. My hands are dry now, so I can do that.
Imagine I did a really long painting like this. That's wild. Hey, come back. Anyway, that'll be another day. I'm gonna go wash my hands, bye. I don't know what I have to do besides a few more drawings. It's gonna be easy. Okay, so the next thing I wanna do here, make a house before I rudely was interrupted. Naughty. Now where's my white paint? <laughs> I'm sorry you had to witness that yesterday. And you were born out of an accident. <laughs> Just know this. <laughs> I'm gonna make a house. So back to what I was doing. I was gonna use this to make the front. This is such a waste of paint. Play is hard in the way that you have to be like, this is for nothing. Yeah, I've got some materials here that I really, really covered and love. Oh, so, oh, no. Oh, that bugs me a lot too. How can someone get so distracted that they don't rush and wash their brush? Lucky this brush doesn't matter, but still could have been a good one. Then we're gonna get our beloved crayons. Next step is this. Whoops, this is bad. <laughs> this doesn't make any sense, oh well. <laughs> yeah, it's called nature. What are, you, what are you gonna do about it? Nature versus nurture. It's abstract, so yeah, I wouldn't be point fingered over here. <laughs> How did I even do that? This is why I have to draw the right way around because things get a bit much. That poor sweet house, what are we gonna do about her? She can't go on like this. Oh well, let's just do some more stars, shall we? Well, we can do some type. What kind of type should we do? <laughs> I do feel good. This makes me feel really confident about working at a larger scale. And I do feel like I need that confidence right now, or at least I needed to break the ice in that way. Cause sometimes it's not as daunting as you make it out to be in your mind, you know? She needs some friends. When I say friends, I mean she needs some details added to her. Oh, I can give her this peachy toned skin. I should have done the um, theatre job with this, but like large scale with an oil pastel, that would have been really interesting. I should try and do like a more refined shape of shape that I practice or something, or even light box, but like large scale onto paper. I'll add some blue, who's to stop me? Oh, well, that's lovely with the yellow. The black outline's are interesting because I don't really use it that much in my work. It's crazy that I did it for that theatre project because I don't ever do black outlines. So it's quite crazy that I did it on a commercial project and didn't even think twice about it, I feel. I wish that oil pastels that were really good or like that are good were not that expensive, but it's okay, I get it. <laughs> you can't go, unless you're like making lots of money from your artwork and selling lots of finished artwork, I feel like you can't like go crazy with it, which is annoying. You know, it's such an investment, especially for like artists that are beginning. This is like pretty good though. I guess this isn't that expensive. The Sennelier ones, which is expensive. No fizzy drink for me today. <laughs> Day one without double tea. Am I gonna plan to do it? No, I'm not. I'm just trying to be that guy on TikTok. Wait, there's more. Probably better without the lines. It's okay though. It's very freeing. And what we do here? You just went backwards without even looking at Sean. Everything's fine. <laughs> I love doing crazy stars, they're so <sighs> relaxing. I feel good. I got it out. It's out, it's out of me. <laughs> Let's look at the whole thing. It's a doodle. 
a big one. do something today I am gonna do something you are gonna watch the thing perhaps if you want to stay you can if you want to go you can I'm not the boss of you if you want to stay you can <laughs> are you my friends I guess you're a little bit like my internet pen pals boom 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 anyway I hope you enjoyed this video it's just a bit of fun nothing crazy I'm kind of emotionally preparing for Peachtober, so I'm trying to include a lot of play while I prep for it, put together the prompt list and emotionally prepare for like the month of chaos. <laughs> anyway, I want to say a big thank you to you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you get to do something like this once in a while too. But then Ikea sells like big rolls of paper too. So you can always do this if you want. It's pretty freeing. I definitely recommend it. Especially if there's art supplies you want to use up and not ones that you don't want to use and spill all over the ground. That would be great. Anyway, I also want to say a big thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring this video. As per usual, you guys know Squarespace is an all-in-one platform for building your website. I love it. Will I put this on there? I'll probably put this on my blog. It's less of a portfolio piece and more of like a look at this fun thing I made piece. While we were like filming and stuff, I also took some photos on my phone. So I think that's what I'll include on my little blog post. But yeah, I had lots of fun. Squarespace is the best because it's so easy to use. You guys know I love it. I don't even know what else to say anymore besides like if you haven't tried it, like why haven't you? I've told you it's the best. I've seen a lot of peers that tell you it's the best. Like some of my favorite channels also tell you it's the best, but it also is definitely like it's honestly objectively the best. <laughs> in my opinion. It's so easy to use. What I like about my theme is that it's designed so that the store and the gallery page looks the same and I really like that. I feel like I'm a sucker for consistency and I really like that when I have a store drop it looks the same as my portfolio and I just freaking love Squarespace. Do I need to say more? No, I don't. It's really good. Go to squarespace.com slash peach and you'll get a free trial and 10% off your first purchase. Thank you Squarespace. That's all I have to say. This was just for fun, so I don't really have a debrief here. Are you guys ready for Peachtober? Because I have all of the words, and I think I'm going to drop them in early September. So that's in less than a month. That means you can start prepping if you want to, if you want to be involved. If you just want to be a spectator, that's fine too. I feel like I would love to just be a spectator too, but I cannot. I simply can't. And not because of your pressure, because of me. So anyway, that's all I have to say on that. I think I just love to be a spectator because then I could see more pieces. I feel like I don't get to see all of the pieces because I'm also participating and also checking the hashtag. I just feel like I'd miss things. I don't know. I want to do it all, you know. Anyway, bye everyone. I hope you have a nice day. It's so warm in the studio. It's so sunny and sweet and warm. I'm very relaxed right now. It's like I could sleep here. Good night, everyone. You can watch me sleep for five seconds.